Alright. All right. Oh. oh no. Oh, interesting. Alright. Very interesting. So, we got ourselves a special unboxing. These just came in the mail not too long ago today at my front steps from Costco. And so basically, I ordered myself a, a 24 count of Kirkland Signature Golf Balls. These aren't just the regular Kirkland uh, version 3 balls, but these are the new neon yellow balls. So we're going to get a chance to take a look what's inside, an unboxing, and uh, yeah, let's do it. Alright, let's give this a cup. Alright, thanks to Costco for sending these so quickly. I ordered these like probably like just two days ago and boom, quickly it just came at my front steps. Bam! Alright. Ooh, here's the, the packaging in itself. Take a look. Looks very similar to the original black box of the white balls. And uh, yeah, man, neon yellow, check that out. Let's open this up. All right, here we go. Let's take these out. Pretty similar to the white ones. This is pretty cool. Yeah, it's got the same logo on there. And then the Performance Plus line. So yeah, you got one through four. They're labeled one through four different balls. So again, I'll take these guys out here. So I got the white ones here so we can compare the two. Look at the box they're they're pretty much the same like very similar the same style just one is neon yellow and the other is white but pretty much using the same black uh, box but let's let's compare the the two the different balls to each other here I mean just based off of the colors yeah the Kirkland signature the the logo really sticks out They feel the same. I feel like they feel the same. Um, uh, the other ball that most people like to use that are that's colored are the Pro V1 from Titleist. So if we want to compare those two here, like the Titleist, it feels like it's more shiny. There's some shiny like metallic to it but the Kirkland is very similar to the white balls of the original white balls. And yeah, I mean, they're very different between the two when you look at them up close. I don't know how they would do in performance. Probably, I'm, I'm, I'm assuming the Kirkland neon yellow would probably do pretty similar in performance as the, the white ones. And so that's my guess. I thought it would be kind of cool. I know I've seen people do this in the past, but um, with like golf ball reviews and stuff. I do have a pipe cutter here. So I thought it would be kind of cool to maybe open it up uh, and compare the two, the white one and the yellow one. All right, All right. Oh. oh no. Oh, interesting, all right. Very interesting. All right, this is what the yellow one looks like on the inside here. And then I already cut the white, the white one. And so here's the white one. You can tell like the yellow one has yellow on the outside and then the second layer is white and then the middle part is pink. But then you have the white Kirkland balls where the outside shell is of course white and then the second layer is gray and the middle is red. 
Yeah, I really like the fact that Kirkland is now giving us golf customers or consumers more options. I know a lot of people who use colored balls and I think this may be a great option, especially just because of the price for each of these balls. The other thing too, may, may, it may not, maybe the performance is a lot different just based off of seeing the differences in the inside. You know, I didn't, I honestly thought they were going to be the same color in the inside, but clearly when I cut them up, they're two different, they're just two different colors. And so maybe it's just a color thing and it's the same uh, material. Who knows? I'm not an expert on that, but honestly, good job, Kirkland. I love that they're expanding and trying new things. Thanks for checking out this unboxing. This was pretty cool and it was fun. I was excited to do this one. And uh, if you have any questions or anything, comments, thoughts, uh, but please do subscribe and like. That would be helpful. Um, and yeah, I'll talk to you guys soon. Later.